My very distinguished viewers, good day and welcome back to our YouTube channel, Everyday People's Voice, your trusted media platform for breaking news in politics, business, current affairs, analysis, opinions, headlines, sports, entertainment, and so much more, with a comprehensive up-to-date news coverage aggregated from sources all over the world and every corner of the globe. Our sources of information are reliable and accurate. That's why we are the world-leading liberal voices for the everyday people in Nigeria. I want to thank you all for staying tuned. But before I go further, if this is your first time of coming across our prestigious YouTube channel, please be so kind to subscribe, like and share our videos so that our God will keep on blessing you. Thank you all for staying tuned. My culture people, according to our correspondent, Femi Bajabi Amila, the chief of staff to President Bola Ahmed Tinubu, reassured Nigerians that the country will soon begin to see the results of the president's efforts. <laughs> My country people, I don't know how I'm going to take this matter. Oh. But waiting this chief of staff, they talk so. It be like say, it makes sense. I be it not make sense. We're going to talk about the comment section. Because waiting this man, they try to tell us so. Now say, it they reassure Nigerians. Say they go so see the fruit of the labor of President Tinubu. Bajabi Abela made this comment following President Tinubu's return to Nigeria after a two-week stay abroad. He expressed confidence that Tinubu has now rested and rejuvenated <laughs> and would continue to steer the nation in the right direction, working to address the challenges currently facing Nigerians. My country people, going forward, now say the chief of staff they try to tell us now say Tinubu don't go reawaken himself. Whether I go lecture, I be go for brain treatment. I don't know. Because before he leave, the country was in a state of mess. So, for chief of staff to tell us, say, he don't go come back, go rejuvenate. I be go change the blood. The way they say, Buari do that time. I don't know what you say, Tinubu go do come back, we go make this country better. But with the wait to see him, say, he don't come back after the two weeks to make Nigeria better. And if he make Nigeria better, now to all of us, we go happy, we go thank the president. With the see so, Bajabi Amila, speaking to reporters at the Inabdi Azikiwe airport in Abuja, acknowledged the hardship many Nigerians are enduring, but urged Patience. You don't see also for the airport where they take a welcome to Nibu. In talk and say, in no say Nigerians, they pass through serious hardship and serious endurance. They go on. It be like endurance trekking. When we trek for youth service that year, then be waiting. This a but Jabi Amelia don't talk for grand. He said, but. Make Nigerians they patient. Say everything go they okay. But we don't know the time where the thing will take they okay. Because this now uh, one year plus into this new administration, things they get worse. Things they go bad every day. People don't go feel afford three square two square me, say. Some people don't feel afford one square me. Now we don't know who should be low class, we don't know who should be high class, low should be middle class. Everybody is hungry. In Nigeria, but according to him, he said Tinubu administration has been putting in the necessary work 
over the past year and half, and the benefit will soon be visible. Now, you say the benefit will be visible. But look at petrol. Look at the cost of living. It won't will kill the living. People, when they live now, they fear. Okay, see for one place when I go which day, the man go police station. He, he, he go prison. He say he, no, he won't stay prison. What he happen? He said because of prison that they give free food. Another businessman can't talk say he don't look for business where he go do no business is profitable. No money to even do business. He said he won't take, turn the house to do police station. Make police call rent there, make police. You can imagine the kind of business where people they think these days. Say one put police station. Say go only every day make money now. You they say so. But the kind of work when Tinubu has been doing in the last one and a half years requires some rest. And he has gone on leave. And he is back well rejuvenated. That's what the chief of staff talk. He emphasized that the president had taken the much needed break to recover his energy and would now continue implementing policies aimed at improving the lives of Nigerians. Bashabi Amila reassured the public that the policies Tinubu has been putting in place are designed to address Nigerians' economic challenge and set the country on the path of recovery. He urged Nigerians to remain hopeful and patient, adding that the administration's work would soon yield tangible benefits. In a matter of time, Nigerians will begin to see the fruit of his labor and our labor, Bajabeya Mihalia stated. Just to continue from where he left off in terms of putting policies in place and making sure things are doing right, making sure we are going in the right direction, the chief of staff emphasized that the government remains committed to the principles of Renewed hope, a key slogan of Tinubu's administration. My country people, this is where I go live on today. But when I see how the country be, the hunger in Nigeria is unbearable. When I see also, the first subsidy remover is a joke, which we all know is a fraud. But by now, I believe, say, Tidubu make him no say he no go come back for next term. I will see you again for my next video. Until then, make sure stay blessed and bye bye.